Hello everybody, this is Kiyoshi here. Welcome back to another video. In this video, I'll be reviewing the McDonald's Happy Meal Toys DC Teen Titans Go number 7 Robin Starfire set. So without further ado, let's get started. We'll take a look at the packaging first. Here are Robin and Starfire. Looking nice. Robin is my favorite one. Here's some use your Robin and Starfire stickers to play tic-tac-toe. Awesome. Cool. Um, let's open it. I have not opened it yet, so I'm pretty excited. Um, I did review number three Robin earlier. Um, so I kind of expect these kind of post poster looking stuff. Okay, it's empty now. Cool. Here is the shopped pencils, color pencils. Amazing, I do like these a lot. I think kids will love it. And here's a sticker that you can play tic-tac-toe. Awesome, I think this is for tic-tac-toe. This is just for sticker purposes. Nice. Cool, next um, we have this thing. Let's zoom out a bit. Let's take a look. Um, well, once again, these are like actual poster size. So it's pretty amazing. The quality is great too. The paper has some thickness to it it feels nice it doesn't feel cheap so it's nice and uh, i'll try my best i move this to the side move these to the side so i can show you guys um so yeah here's the top teen titans go logo and here we have robin and starfire uh, nice these are for color paintings um i think that can keep kids busy and leave parents alone Four. It depends on the kids. Some kids can last a couple hours until they finish it. Some kids may last just 30 minutes or so, but still, that gives parents time to just chill, you know? And also, I think it's very interactive. It's good for kids to, um, to really do something creative with their brain. And here's the other, flip the other side. Here we have Teen Titans Go in Creative Cleanup Part 7. Here we have writer, art, letters, and editor. This is basically like comic cubes. Um, to show you guys, this is huge. So it's very hard to show you guys all in one. So I have to do section by section. Um, cool. And here's Robin. Yep, all of these, you can do whatever to it. You can, you can paint it. Um, I think when I was a kid, usually I would paint it and then I would cut these things out. Uh, I would cut the characters out and just play them in my hands, like, you know, paper characters. Um, uh, I don't know how, uh, how the kids nowadays, they do. I mean, of course, it's a little bit different. When I was a kid, my parents don't allow me to, um, to have a lot of those handheld games. I only have Game Boy, but my parents will limit the time that you know uh, my allowed time to play video games are very limited usually i can only do that on the weekends and i'm not allowed to um play computer games uh, except on the weekends i mean of course uh after i got into uh junior high things change i can i can't i can have all those freedoms to myself but um prior to junior high when i was a little kid to like primary school uh wise um most of the time I have to create my own toys because um, my parents aren't, aren't really buying me a lot of toys. Um, so a lot of time I see characters on magazines or these kind of, um, you know, paint it yourself kind of characters. I would just color them, whatever I wanted, and I would just cut them out. You know, character by character, I can have this thing cut out, for example, and I'll cut out this, I'll cut out this, and I just play with them on my hands, like they're fighting or they're forming a team, villains, etc. It's 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 fun times, you know. I I I'm still very young. I don't have kids, but uh, if I do eventually, I think I will introduce that game to them. Uh, I mean, I understand nowadays the kids have a lot of things to do. You know, um, probably they, the the moment they go to school, they already have cell phones. But when I was little, I don't have cell phones until like, when did I start with cell phones? junior high yeah my life changed dramatically starting junior high that's my when my parents gave me a lot of freedoms gave me a lot of um just whatever i want to do to myself <laughs> as long as it's legal as long as it doesn't bother people they'll let me do it as long as i can keep up my grades they'll let me do whatever i want it but prior to that um as a little kid 
Um, I don't have a lot of toys to, to play with or video games, so I do really appreciate these paints, painting stuff, you know, like to kill time. And also, like I mentioned, I will cut them out and just play them as a paper toys. Yep, so here is my review of McDonald's Happy Meal, the Teen Titans Go number seven, Robin and Starfire set. I think this is amazing. I think um, you should get it to your kids. You know, these are available in any participating McDonald's restaurants. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.